this is a beer bottle, right? You know what I gotta do. I gotta do it. Drink it like a beer, right? I'm hot sauce chunky Tim and today's show is going to be a barbecue sauce review. Now this is sent to me from Vic Klinko. He is the GM of Hot Shots Incorporated based out of High Point, North Carolina. Now a while back, if you guys know, uh, Vic got a hold of me on Facebook and asked me if I was interested in reviewing a up and coming product for Motley Crue. You know what I said. Give me a hell yeah. So as you can see right there. That's what he sent me. I reviewed all the bottles of hot sauce from Motley Crue. Each member's got their own bottle. Um, all those reviews are on the channel on checkout. From then on, um, he got a hold of me again and said, hey, I got some more stuff for you. So he sent me a box of barbecue sauces. Um, I reviewed one, um, so we're on to number two. All right, <clears throat> again, this one, just like the last one, has the can koozie, which is very cool. We could never have enough of these. Never have enough of these. And uh, so, yeah, let's hop to it here, folks. All right, so this is the Brew BQ IPA. Now, the last one I reviewed was the Brew BQ Lager. This is going to be the IPA version. Now, IPA beers have... Uh, growing in popularity throughout the years. I remember when I was young and going out to the bars and partying like crazy. Um, I don't recall IPA beers even existing. Now they're all over the place. I never even knew what IPA st stood for. I thought it was like an independent, you know, like a, not independent brewing because obviously it doesn't stand for IPA. It would be IB. You know what I'm saying. Um, so yeah, I didn't know what it meant. So what did I do? Come on, you know what I did. I looked it up. So it says here that IP stands for India Pale Ale. Um, you can read on if you want. I'm not going to read on, but Indiana Pale Ale. I didn't know that. So I'm sure a lot of people probably did, but I didn't. I'm just, I'm just saying. So, okay. So anyway, so like, like the last one, it looks just like a beer bottle, which is cool. Um, it's got the little beer cap there. If I remember last time, so I came prepared. I got my bottle opener here. Um, so the bottle's cool. I like the little flames right there. It's got a good eye-peeling eye look to it for sure. Um, craft beer infused. I usually pop open a beer, you hear that noise. Let's see what this makes that same sound. Let's see. Yeah, I didn't think so. All righty. It smells like barbecue sauce. Well, no fucking shit. And you know what? I am actually getting a little roll of, of, of beer. I didn't think I was going to. Ha. So like last time, it's got this little rubber uh, grommet here. That's how I put the, uh, the cap back on because obviously you can't re reuse this, right? So good good call there. Good, good idea. I don't have a little snipper to snip this off, so... Well, I'll deal with it later. All right, let's check out the pour. Hmm. Yeah, I'm actually kind of surprised I can smell the the, the, the IPA beer in this. I'm out, so let's drink it, Tim. Let's do this. is good all right now you probably ask yourself well how it's like drunk Tim usually review products that got some sort of spice pepper heat to it right of course so looking at this I didn't really see anything advertised saying that there's any heat or any peppers to it so pull up the ingredient list here you go again not gonna read all that but you can see right there guys jalapeno jalapeno hot sauce Worcestershire sauce. Gotta love saying that word. That's such a funny word. Um, blah, blah, blah. Chili powder. Blah, blah, blah. Jalapeno powder. Look at that. 
contains anchovies. So, barbecue sauce. Obviously, usually people barbecue in the summertime. Um, I barbecue all year round. Uh, we actually barbecued uh, steaks for New Year's. Um, so yeah, we barbecue all year round. One thing I like to barbecue up, and put barbecue sauce on, is some pork chops. All right, so I got a pork chop here. I'm gonna dump this on here. Because like I said, guys, we all like having hot sauces, but the only true way to enjoy hot sauce is to have it with some food. Or barbecue sauce for that matter. All right, so I'm gonna cut it up here. I know this is gonna be a good combination because I do it all the time, but this is just for you guys, for your viewing pleasure. Well, like always, one well, theme my face here. It says here, barbecue barbecue sauce are famous for bold flavors and spices that bring the craft beer experience to your grill. Our IPA is a hoppy experience. Hoppy. Or happy. Or both. This is blending a touch of citrus with jalapeno peppers and brown sugar. So, that's it. So, it's got jalapeno peppers in it, so it's not going to be not gonna be hot. Um, it's going to be enjoyable. So... I'll we'll finish this up here. Vic Klinko. Check this out. It says here he's currently the world's largest collector of hot sauces. Well, again, like I said, Vic got a hold of me on Facebook. We're Facebook friends. I've come across a couple pictures he put online. Yeah, that's quite the hot sauce collection, eh? All right, so online here they have a heat rating of a one. I think that's a pretty good legit number for sure. Um, I do feel a little bit of burning in the back of the throat actually. Um, very slight, very slim. Just being honest. Um, but um, this is absolutely delicious. Uh, again, I'm a huge, huge, huge fan of spicy barbecue sauces. Um, the last bottle of barbecue sauce sent me uh, went very quickly. Actually, my family enjoyed it with me because it wasn't that crazy hot. So, again. Mild sauce fans out there, I know you do uh, watch, like to enjoy the uh, milder, um, spicy food reviews I do, so I'm glad to uh, appease you. Um, <clears throat> again, can koozie. <clears throat> so Hot Shots Distributing Incorporated. Rick, thank you so much for sending me the uh, three bottles of barbecue sauce. I got one left. Um, which I will review that in the near future. <clears throat> so if you guys are interested in ordering uh, this barbecue sauce or any other barbecue sauce that Hot Shots should be incorporated sells, I'll drop the link down below. <clears throat> this is a beer bottle, right? You know what I gotta do. I gotta do it. Drink it like a beer, right? Mm. Delicious. Absolutely delicious. Absolutely delicious. <clears throat> delicious. The next time, hot sauce junkie Tim and a funeral pepper.